We're sitting here at a project that we just completed about a month ago. Jody is now taking it over and going to landscape it. And it's like my baby. When we work as diligently and hard as we do at creating something that we can really all enjoy, it's hard to give it away. In this particular case though, the handover is pretty smooth and easy because Jody is an extension of us. And Jody's company and what she does is really an extension of how we feel about things. So it's, it's time for me to hand it over to you and let you make me look good, which I really appreciate is the landscaping can either make or break a project. And I talk oftentimes how landscapers try to over landscape. They, and, and maybe it's an overselling because they make more money in plants or something. But I see an awful lot of projects that are overdone. And I think in an environment like this, just enough. Simple is good. Keeping it simple and yet interesting and elegant is important, but not overdoing it. And that's certainly something, Jody, from the gardener perspective, and, and she's a horticulturalist, so she has that feel. It's not about how much money I can make per plant, but whether how can I use the right plant to accentuate the hardscape that's around, and I really appreciate that. So why don't you share a little bit of that in terms of your feeling about that? The one thing that you guys always create is a great setting um, to express it in plant material and plant life. One of the things that is specific to it is that it has to have a specific rhythm, be an accent to what has been developed here. The thing is, is again, a lot of the time the spaces are small, they're not large yards, and so you have to make sure that it's scaled with the plant material to be proportionate and show off the creation of the pool and the grottos or the slides or any of the other accents that have been put into place. The cool thing is, with the, especially this project, um, once going into the steampunk Caribbean, it gives me a theme that I can run with and find the exact plant material that's just going to make everything come to life, literally.